A big report into the mental health of Aussie school kids was released recently, and the results have many experts concerned. Many kids reported feeling stressed and unhappy. Others said they don't get nearly enough sleep. We asked Tash to look through the results and find out how some kids stay resilient through tough times. Life is full of challenges. Some involve family, some friends, and some school. Some of them are easy to cope with, but others can leave you feeling sad, stressed, or just alone. A recent study found half of school kids aren't coping very well with some of these challenges. 16,000 kids in years 4 to 12 were surveyed. 28% of boys and 38% of girls said they don't get enough sleep. One in three girls is unhappy and almost the same number of boys feel like they're always under stress. One in four boys and one in three girls say they're losing confidence in themselves and nearly half of all kids say they've been bullied at school. But why? Well, there are lots of reasons why we can feel stressed, anxious or worried. It might be a family breakdown, like if your parents decide to separate. You might feel pressure at school with assignments and tests. There might be a death in the family or illness which affects your emotions. Or you could be experiencing bullying. So, what kinds of things stress or worry you? My mum had pneumonia a few years ago and she had to be in hospital for a while and it was hard. When I've got a big footy match coming up, like a grand final or a semi-final, to get in it's just... You, the day before that you're thinking, oh, we've got to win this, we have to. I recently like moved overseas from England to Australia and that was kind of hard for me because all my family is over there. My grandma died a few weeks ago. Yeah. Yeah. And, and was that hard as well, dealing with that with, with school and what? Yeah, that was. When I've got lots of work to do at school and I don't think I can do it, I just try to get through it and think of ideas to get off my mind how hard it's going to be. And how does it make you feel? I get butterflies and like feel sick and like getting headaches with stressful stuff. I normally feel sad and I don't really want to talk to anyone. I just want to be by myself and try to get over it by myself. I lose my confidence and I just, like, I can't really talk. There are lots of ways kids deal with how they're feeling. These guys take part in boxercise classes twice a week before school. How do you deal with it? I talk to my friends and my parents and because I can trust them. I like go running because then I don't really focus on like what's upsetting me. Well for me it tends to be sport and having a good time and just forgetting about everything like to wipe out your memory and just having a fun time, go to the movies, bowling, anything. For me it would be music because it like really calms you down. I like to talk to my dog because then, um, like, she can't answer back, so she can't say something mean or something. <laughs> Some great ideas there. But if you did identify with any of the feelings we mentioned in that story, there is always someone you can talk to about it. Kids Helpline is a good place to start. Hit their website or go to ours for more details.